So find the value of k if the line joining the origin with the points of intersection of the curve two x square minus two x y plus three y square plus two x minus y minus one equals to zero, and the line x plus two y is equals to k are mutually perpendicular. So first take the given curve equation and the line equation. Okay. So here I am writing the given curve. Given curve. Okay. So given curve is two uh, x square. Minus two x y plus three y square plus two x minus y minus one equal to zero. Take it as equation number one and the line. Okay, so what about the line? Line is x plus two y is equal to k. Okay, either you can consider this as k uh, equation two. Otherwise, okay. So after dividing. Okay, so here dividing by k on both sides. Dividing by k on both sides. Okay, so now if we divide by k on both sides, then x plus two y by k is equals to k by k is equals to k by k. So k and k get cancelled, so we get equal to one. Okay, so that means x plus two y by k. Is equal to one. This is equation number three. This equation three we are substituting in equation one. Okay. So that means homogenizing. Okay. So homogenizing homogenizing equation one homogenizing equation one with Equation three, okay, means this equation one I am writing as two x square minus two x y plus three y square plus two x minus y minus one minus one equal to zero. Okay, so in this, what I am doing here? So here power two, here power one plus one is two, here power two. All the okay, so Homogeneous equation means all the powers must be equal. Here the powers uh, are two, and here the powers are uh, one. X power one, y power one, and constant power is zero. Constant means power is zero. There is no variables here. Okay, so that's why. That's why. So here I am multiplying by one. I am multiplying by one. I am multiplying by one square. So when we multiply by one or one square, there is no change in the value. That one replaced with this equation three. So that means we get two x square minus two x y plus three y square plus two x into y uh, one. One means I am replacing x plus two y by k minus y into one. One is nothing but x plus two y divided by k minus one into One square that is x plus two y by k, okay, whole square is equals to zero. Okay, now here two x square minus two x y plus three y square. Okay, so here LCM divided by k divided by k in both of these terms, so we get divided by k. We can write that directly. Okay, so k and two x into x is two x square. Okay, two to the four x into y x y minus y into x minus x y minus y into two y minus two y square. Okay, and minus of here minus of uh, a plus b whole square formula. Okay, so the denominator also we get k square. The denominator also we get k square a plus b whole square. So that means we get x square plus two y whole square. Minus plus two ab two into x into two y. Okay, is equals to zero. Equals to zero. Okay, so now in this, in this, take a k square common. Take k square common. If you take k square common, if you take k square common, then. Then what we get? Okay, so 
Here LCM is k square. LCM is k square. Okay, so now here uh, k square into k square into. Okay, so multiply these three terms. Multiply the first three terms by k square. So that means 2x square minus 2xy plus 3y square. Okay, plus. Okay, multiply this term by k. If you multiply this term by k, k into 2x square plus 4xy minus xy. Either you can write as it is like that or 4xy minus xy is 3xy into k. 3xy into k or 3kxy. 3kxy. Okay. No, no, no. So we have, we written the k outside. So just write it as this: 4xy minus xy is 3xy minus 2y square. Okay, minus 2y square as this. Okay. So minus of minus of here k square k square as this. No need to. Okay. So change anything. 4y square and 2 to the 4xy plus 4xy. Okay, and equal to zero as this. Okay, so now multiply inside. If you multiply inside, okay, so 2k square, 2k square into x square minus 2k square xy plus 3k square y square plus 2k x square plus 3k xy minus 2k y square minus x square minus 4y square minus 4xy is equal to 0 into k square becomes 0. We, we are taking this k square to that side. We are dividing if you take it to that side, multiplies. Now, take x square common in all the terms. Okay, 2k square and x square common means plus 2k here, plus 2k and x square common means minus 1, minus 1 okay into x square and xy common okay so xy common means if we take xy common so then what we get okay minus 2k square xy and plus 3k xy so plus 3k we get okay and xy minus 4 minus 4 into xy next y square term 3k square okay 3k square y square and uh, minus 2k minus 2k y square minus 4 y square minus 4 okay into y square okay is equal to 0. Now this is in the form of ax square plus b x b uh, 2hxy plus b y square is equal to 0. General okay homogeneous equation of a pair of straight lines by comparing by comparing with by comparing with a x square plus 2 h x y plus b y square is equals to zero. Okay, this is a pair of straight lines equation. We are comparing with this. Okay, if we compare with this, then what is a value? A is nothing but x square coefficient. That means 2 k square plus 2 k minus one. And what is 2 h value? Okay, that is minus 2k square plus 3k minus 4. Okay, and what is b? Okay, b is nothing but 3k square minus 2k minus 4. This is a b value. This is b value. Now, what is the formula here? What he is asking? Okay, he is asking to find the value of k when they are mutually perpendicular. If they are mutually perpendicular, Okay, so if they are mutually perpendicular, so I am writing here, if they are, if they are mutually perpendicular, mutually perpendicular, okay, so then what is the formula, here the formula is coefficient of x square coefficient of x square plus coefficient of y square 
is equal to zero. Or coefficient of x square a and coefficient of y square b equal to zero. This is the formula. Okay. What is x square coefficient? Just check and uh, substitute the values. Okay. So if we substitute the values, two k square plus two k minus one. So write that value. 2k square plus 2k minus 1. Okay. 2k square plus 2k minus 1. And uh, B value. 3k square minus 2k minus 4. 3k square minus 2k minus 4. Okay. Equal to 0. 2k square and 3k square. That is 5k square. Okay. Here 2k, 2k gets cancelled. We can cancel this 2k and 2k. Minus 1 minus 4 is minus 5. Minus 5 equal to 0. Take 5 common k square minus 1 equal to 0. k square minus 1 is equal to 0 by 5 is equal to 0. k square is equal to 1. k is equal to. Okay, so root 1 or we get plus or minus 1. Okay, so here what he is asking, he is asking to find the value of k. Okay, so that means root 1. So that means the value of k is plus or minus 1. This is the required solution. Understood? 